Hi guys, Sam Chow here again with my latest creation. These are the crunk drawers. Now there's a really specific reason why I named these crunk drawers, but I'll save that for a later video, so subscribe. But since I'm obsessed with acronyms, I'm still gonna go ahead and call these the completely redesigned, unique new kitchen crunk drawers. Now I did actually redesign these kitchens from my original uh, design, the kitchen and mattress platform, camp drawers. Uh, if you haven't watched those videos, check out the link in the description. So we'll start out here in the back. On the, on, under this counter space, we got lift top mechanism. So we can have counter space and still be able to access our items below. I worked in a shallow compartment here for a bit of organization, but otherwise it's a big open space to store larger items or most likely used as a pantry for groceries. Moving on, we got, the, we got a stove a grill and a griddle. So you have all the versatility to cook whatever you want in the backcountry. The stove has a nice glass top here, which gives a little bit, bit of a premium touch, but also serves as a windbreak. The grill griddle has its own windbreak, as well as having grease traps. Both units are from Greystone and they run on propane with uh, fittings on the back with quick releases so you can run a hose to your vehicle. Got a pull-out cutting board, which is self-supported, and it's huge. Prep space is always crucial for cooking, and uh, I always make sure to incorporate the biggest cutting board that I can in all my kitchen builds. All right, moving up forward, I got this long countertop. In total, I have five and a half feet of countertop space, uh, not including the cutting board. And this has a secret underneath. It's also a lift top. We got our storage here for, I call this about pot, for pots and pans, dishware, that sort of thing. And of course, up here, we got our silverware drawer, which is a drawer, which will lead down to our final compartment down the, on the bottom. As far as construction goes, the whole thing is made from half-inch birch plywood and uh, finished in polyurethane. And the countertops are uh, Formica Jet Sequoia. The box is made from a Raptor liner, co coated in Raptor liner, that is. And uh, the whole system is two feet wide, five feet long, 16 inches tall. And the whole unit, including the stove and griddle, is uh, right around 225 pounds. Each drawer unit sits on heavy duty full extension drawer slides and they both support up to 550 pounds. So that's the crunk drawers. I was commissioned to build these for a travel trailer RV's exterior storage compartment, which was uh, the travel trailer sits a little bit lower than this pickup truck, um, which is probably why you might've noticed it's a little bit tall in addition to me being really short. But uh, I wanted to do this video and uh, I didn't have the travel trailer with me because it's in Georgia and I'm in Washington. In fact, this whole unit is actually gonna get crated up and shipped out there tomorrow, but I wanted to take this time to make a video before I say bye to my creation. But this is certainly not the last time I'm gonna be building a set of drawers. And now I'd like to officially announce that Camp Drawers is officially in business. I'm accepting pre-orders. So check out my website at campdrawers.com for more details. And if you want to get a, if you want to get a unit like this, some crunk drawers for yourself, definitely let me know in the comments uh, if you want it for your overland vehicle, trailer, RV, whatever you want a mobile kitchen in. Let me know. I might be able to add crunk drawers to the lineup. Lastly, I just wanted to thank all my subscribers and viewers for for tuning in. Really, um, without you guys this build would not be possible. It's kind of a crazy story how I was contacted to build these um, because where they're going, it's pretty awesome. But you'll have to tune in for that on the later video. In addition to that, I will be releasing a full start to finish build video, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you out there.